It's time. Me and Cutie recently got into watching reality TV. We've been watching this show on Netflix called Too Hot to Handle, where it's just five hot dudes and five hot chicks, and they really want a bone, but if they do, they don't make as much money. But they want a bone so bad that they're down to risk money. It's as trash as TV can get, but I remember watching the entire time with a slight yearning. For something a little more real. People I can relate to. Which is why I thought it's time once again to return to the button. Today we got two button videos to take a look at. Of course, how does it work? Well, let the button take it away. Welcome to the button, a speed dating show. When the button lights up red, either player may press it and swap out their date for a new person. Get out of here. If two people can last on a date for 10 minutes, they win an all expenses paid second date. My name is I'm glad we are not watching the blindfold edition. I think the blindfold edition is mostly a gimmick because at the end of the day, they take off the blindfolds to decide anyway. It's Bonk. Nice to meet you. Bonk. What the fuck are those thighs? My God. I'm blocking this with my camera. Dude, look at these thighs. Sorry, I was just marveling. Look at these fucking goliaths. You need like level 83 wood cutting to chop these puppies down. And the tricep definition on the handshake? This dude is big, big dude. Yes. I'm Sophia. Where are you from? I'm from Bulgaria originally. He doesn't fit in the chair. <laughs> Damn, Bonko's ripped. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love to work out. <laughs> Do you work out? Um, yeah. How many times a week? I'm probably not as much as you. <laughs> What's your favorite exercise in the gym? <laughs> he is way too obsessed with working out. Yeah, we get you're fucking ripped, but you can't be ripped. Wear a small shirt on your clearly large body. Have your tree trunk thighs out. Start with the big bicep flex. And then ask, do you work out? What's your favorite exercise? You got to have a personality on top of being a gym rat. You can't just be a gym rat and have that be everything you care about. If you're trying to, you know, talk to normal humans who, hey, don't care. <laughs> a lot of cardio. And then a lot of cardio? What's your favorite cardio machine? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, how many reps do you do? Yeah, I do double that. I do double that. As a warm-up. As a warm-up. You're a little bitch. Do you do bench? <laughs> 75 pounds? That's fucking cringe. I do 475 warm-up, by the way. I guess just the treadmill. The uh, treadmill? Yeah. Do you do incline treadmill? Uh, when they tell me to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Two or three? Two or three? Like, what's the interval? What's the fucking interval? <laughs> what are your favorite? What's your favorite? Right now. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Why did you reject me? I think maybe you work out too much for me. I think you don't work out enough. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You two would have been a cute couple. Probably not. <laughs> Zam. My name's Ken. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm Sophia. That's my daughter's name. Oh, okay. Do you just have one daughter? Mm-hmm. She's four. She's about to be five this February. <laughs> That's crazy. I thought he was fucking around. That's my daughter's name seems like a joke. That, I mean, that face says it all. Is that a deal breaker? Uh, um, I don't know yet, I guess. I don't think so. I guess not. Sophia has had Botox. What do you think of that? <laughs> yeah, it didn't light up red, but I would have got out of here. Oh, Did you really, really get Botox? I have gotten a little Botox. Where at? <laughs> this right here. Oh, uh, that might be crazy. That's a deal breaker? I'm all natural, baby. <laughs> what the fuck? You have a four-year-old kid. Like, I mean, I get it. I get it. People prefer what they prefer. You know, he's all natural. But I feel like a four-year-old kid just in a vacuum is more baggage than, ah, yeah, I do Botox because I don't like wrinkles. Am I crazy? <laughs> Why'd you do that? I'll probably get more Botox, so. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Yeah, we gotta go then. That's good. You can bring a new girl on if you want. It's up to you. Okay, I'm gonna go grab someone else. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, that is sad. I, I don't think I've ever seen someone voluntarily quit without at least being egged on by the producers. But she literally quit the show because she had such a bad experience. <laughs> All right, so what's your deal? <laughs> I realized from this show that most guys have zero riz or too much riz, and there doesn't feel like a good in-between. Like, either they talk to people like you talk to, like, a coworker 
at a water cooler when you don't want to, or they're like, <laughs> yeah, like I'm a Sagittarius, but I could Sagitt bust on you. <laughs> it's, it's like that. There's no in between. I mean, like life-wise, currently I work as a substitute teacher. That's crazy. Um, I do cosplay. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> what? What is? What is this? I can't tell if he's like making fun of her and he's looking around. He's looking around like he got punked by Ashton Kutcher and he can't believe he's sitting across from her. This is fucking crazy. A substitute teacher, you set me up with this bitch? She does cosplay. Okay, uh, I'm a teacher at Franklin. Oh, that's why. That makes more, more sense. And I, yeah, I love going to Comic Con and dressing really? up. So. Oh, that makes way more sense. Saved, saved. I was nervous for a minute. I was nervous he was about to crush her dreams. Fun fact about Xavier. He has an irrational fear of urinals. It's called pieresis, pee shyness. It's a real medical condition. It affects several thousand men and women. How come? <laughs> like in middle school or high school or whatever, if you go to the bathroom, you're just unguarded. Mm -hmm. If anyone lightly taps you, you just like fall into the urinal. So I don't it's know. like a germaphobe kind of a thing? No, it's just like you get pushed into a urinal, so your day is just ruined. Are you down for $1 margaritas? <sighs> Honestly, I thought that was a great play. I don't know if he's built up a, a, a built up enough of a rapport to get there, though. Like, I feel like the entirety of what this guy has done is like, that's crazy. We do like the same shit. That's crazy. We like the same shit. <laughs> that's crazy. I'm really terrified of getting pushed into a urinal, and every time I stand at one, I fear that I will be pushed in and my day will be ruined. One dollar margs. And that's just not flying. It's not flying. I feel like he didn't do enough to switch to the $1 marks. Are you unsure? Go yeah. for it. Yeah. I'm sorry. Back to the dating apps, ask, everybody. Ask her why. I no, I get it. No. I had a good time, though. I, it was really good to meet you. Nice to meet you, Celeste. That's sad. This is sad. This is sad now. Saying no, I get it after getting rejected is sad. No, I get it. This happens a lot. I get it. I would reject me, too, given the chance. How you feeling? You look down. I feel really bad because like I did like him a lot, but also I don't want to not leave my options open, I guess. I'm Celeste. Nice to meet you. Evan. Okay. How old are you? I'm 21. 21? Yeah. You? I'm about to turn 26. How do you feel about younger guys? <laughs> kind of depends on the maturity level, I suppose. All right. Yeah. Okay. What was your most uh, You look so young. Moment? Might be just Sometimes I take more than I give. Okay. In terms of a relationship, I don't know. Just... What the fuck? What? You know, your face is accurate. You have an apt face, my good sir, because I don't understand. I mean, you do look young, but I, his face is fucking hilarious. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'll get. I'll get. She was really connecting with Xavier. <laughs> <laughs> But did you get rid of Xavier? You connected I just, with him? I just wanted to see who else was here, I guess. Would you like to see Xavier again? Yeah. What the fuck are they making this guy? Why are they making him do the dirty work? Why are they making him cuck himself? All yeah. right. Okay, good shit. Okay, here's the thing. And call me a petty bitch. But if I'm Xavier, fuck no. Yeah, she's nice. Yeah, we vibed. Yeah, there's common interests. But you wanted to say no to explore the market. I'm a petty bitch. Fuck that shit. Explore the market. Because me, Xavier, I'm out. All right? I'm going to find someone who appreciates me the first time around. Okay? Because she's doing the thing that people do when, when, you're, when you're having a get-together. And you're like, hey, you want to come hang out at my place? And they're like, huh, maybe. What time? And you're like, 8 p.m. And they're like, hmm, yeah, who's going? And the only reason they're doing all of that is to see if there's anything else that's going on at, at the same time that's more fun rather than just signing up for the thing that you want them to do. And it'd be fun if they could just commit to that rather than uh, having to see if this is like the backup, backup, backup option and the only thing that they have going on rather than something way cooler. What are we talking about? Evan. Yeah. Will you go ask Xavier if he would like to Say no! Him? Of course, of course. Say I'll no, that. Xavier! <laughs> Hold strong! We'll see what he says. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Look who we have here. It was more fun talking with you than the other guys. Appreciate that. <laughs> I do have to hit the button though. Yeah, that's fair. I don't play second chances. That's fair.
Let's go! That's it, baby. Hold strong. Giga Chad. Now I feel bad. Now it'll be sick if he talks to two women, rejects them both, and then brings her back, because then they're on even ground now. Hello. <laughs> How's it going? What's your name? Uh, my name's Aisha. What do you do for work? Business teacher at Lee High School. And then I coach on the side. So what do you coach? Volleyball and basketball. Oh, I did volleyball all throughout high school. That's awesome. I have no idea what I'm doing. Really? And the kids know. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking knew it. I fucking knew that every high school coach had no fucking clue what they were doing. They never say it. They never say it. They're never this curt. But I fucking knew it. So, yeah. Good job. I don't know what, that, what they do. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you hitting it? No. I don't. Oh, you can hit it. I'm sorry. Thank you. I'm out of here. It's nice meeting you, Kyle. How you doing? How you I'm doing? doing good. Did she call him Kyle? I'm out of here. It's nice meeting you, Kyle. How you His name's not Kyle. She didn't even say why. She just said the wrong fucking name. Doing how the other guys do. Um, he was really sweet and stuff. He's really sweet. Just not my type, but it's okay. It's not your type. Do you get? This guy is intense. This guy, I'm getting intense vibes from this. The way he is lean forward and like whisper talking after every single sentence she says. How tall are you? Me? I'm 5'4". Don't buzz him. There's nothing wrong with a short king. Do not buzz him. Who? She did that like it was fucking whack-a-mole. That was the most heartless shit I've ever seen in my fucking life. Oh, she took pleasure out of that. She pressed that like it was a reaction time minigame. Holy shit. I don't think the button will work after that. My fucking god. Who did first? We think she beat you to it, Warren. She beat. Oh, my my hand was on the bottom. I though. appreciate you, Warren. <laughs> oh, come on. Okay. Hi. Hello. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? My name's Asia. Asia. <laughs> nice to meet you, Mecca. Yeah. Mecca. Nice to meet you, Mecca. I like your outfit. Thank you. I appreciate. It. I appreciate it. I have a question. Do you find each other attractive? I would say yes. All right. Let's practice something. Hold each other's hands. Hold each other's hands? All right. Your hands feel kind of coarse. What, coarse? Do, you, what do you do for work? I work with my family's business. Uh, it's a construction services business. Oh, that's why. I'm going to light up one more time. Mm -hmm. And if you don't press me, you win the button. And you get to go on a second date and get to know each other a little bit more. Sounds good. All right, so will you go on a second date with me? I will go on a second date with you. Say less. <laughs> Congratulations. You have won the button. I'm happy for them. Thank Let's you. know when the wedding is. <laughs> Experience naughty and nice. Jesus Christ, that that one. You know what? Hey, shout out to Xavier for holding strong. That's the only thing I care about. He was the realest one there. And the girl who quit at the start actually broke my heart. <laughs> All right, there's one more button video. There's one more button video. Let's take a look. Okay, I have a joke. How much does a roof cost? How much does it cost? Nothing. It's on the house. <laughs> I'm Alex. How you doing, Alex? Nice to meet you. This guy. She was crushing. Alex, that's my kid's name. My kid's four, turn it five. Who? I'm just a fan of the button. I'm just a big fan. Why are you a fan of the button though? You jealous, Ken? I mean, I ain't really the jealous type. Like I don't be in my feelings like that. I know what I'm worth and what I look like. <laughs> He got caught monologuing. Holy shit, he got caught monologuing. No offense. <laughs> yeah, you're Sorry. good. Why did he hit me? I think I'm realizing I'm really looking for somebody's like <laughs> personality and someone's who they are on the inside, you know? Nice Let's... to meet you. My name is Bonko. Nice to meet you. I'm Aww. Alex. Hey, Alex. <laughs> got a question for you. So what do you do? Well, I'm a personal trainer. I like to work out. What do you do? Um, I work in board game development. Bunko, do you play board games? Actually, I do. Yeah? What board games do you like to play? It's like a Bulgarian ones. What's the name of the game? <laughs> it's called lift up a fucking weight and put it down again. Yeah, yeah I'm from Bulgaria. Okay. I'm sorry. That's okay. Why, Why did you press? Because, uh, just not my type. I'm sorry. No problem. What are you looking for? Well, someone that, uh, likes to work out and likes to have fun. You like... <laughs> Everybody likes to think that you go to the gym, get a hot body, girls want you. It's just not how it works. I think you lose all social skills the more weight you know how to lift. You like to work out? I do. What kind of exercises do you like to work out the most? I do like um, high intensity, like interval. Weight lifting? Uh, sometimes. I really like to swim, actually. Okay. Tell them what. <laughs> I don't feel a physical connection. Okay.
Okay, just know I can squat 600 pounds, but it's okay. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good, what's your name? I'm Annika, what's your name? I'm John. Um, so what do you do for work? Um, I'm a barista and I teach like performing arts classes for high school students. John is stressed out. I'm seeing John at like a 95 resting heart rate right now. Do you want to like get married and stuff? Eventually, yes. But you know, of course it would be a, a case where we get to know yeah. each other first. Yeah, I, I feel that. <laughs> Oh my god oh my god you know what that's your fault that's your fault that is her fault because she was trying to be nice she was waiting for him to finish the sentence no, of course it would be a, a case where we look at this look at this look at this double take down to the button to, to know yeah. each other. one first it's red okay two analyze it's yeah. red yeah he has finished speaking I now i go to press it look up break eye contact with the button no urgency here whatsoever I press it too late Ooh, i'm not sorry. ready anymore was it was it was red and then it wasn't okay oh. <laughs> You're not a fucking gamer! Let's go, John! You're in your element now, all right? You are in your element. We have a second chance at life, a second lease at life here. We gotta dial it back a little bit, okay? We were nervous on the first one. Heart rate's high. It's the first person you're talking to, new to the show. Now we know. We know what works, what doesn't work. Let's chill out. Let's relax, you know? Let's vibe. Okay. <laughs> Looks like John beat you to it. That's okay. okay. I'm just not really looking for anything serious. Okay. My... Well, nice to meet you, though. Can I ask what you do for work? I'm a bartender. You are. What do you do? Uh, I'm a preschool teacher. Yeah. Jackie, do you get naughty or nice vibes from John? John is giving really nice vibes. Well, that's good to hear. Do you have a little bit? No, it's not. No, it's not, John. This is really bad. This is. It, she's going to hit the button frame one. I know you think it sounds good, but it's it, she, the fact that she didn't even give you room for naughty is a problem. The bad side? Um, so I'm gonna say no. <laughs> <laughs> You're too sweet, John. You're too sweet. You need to be a little bit of a, a little bit of a bad bitch. <laughs> okay, I'll think of something interesting to say. Um, I guess you could say, um. Okay. He just seems a little nervous. I'm sorry. Okay, it's all right. Nice to meet Bye, you, John. Yeah. Nice to meet you too. He was really nervous. He really was. <laughs> Give him a third try. That's what I've always said about John, is you have to let him cook. First two, he's going to be a little nervous. Heart rate's a little bit high. But by the third one, we are literally talking about the Rizzler. Do you do that to men, Jackie? <laughs> Maybe a little. <laughs> I'm Jackie. Calvin. Calvin, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Can you dance, Kevin? I, I do dance, yes. What kind of dance do you do? I took a private bachata lessons. Bachata? I, yeah. I took a couple of bachata classes. The oh, wow. The fuck you is two bachata? should dance together right now. Right now? <laughs> bachata, bachata, bachata. That was adorable. You're adorable, too. The button or me? Both of you. Oh, okay, yeah. thank you. Let's test. <laughs> Why are you trying to fuck the button? <laughs> Why does everyone want to fuck the button? I don't get it. You two are really cute. Is this going to happen? Why not? I'm open to it. I'm open to it. Yeah. Let's go on a second date. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. I'm going to light up red one last time. If you don't hit me, you win the button. Should have been John. Should have been John. Congratulations. <laughs> you two have won. Cool. Oh, cool. Hey, yeah. <laughs> So, we have a gift from Native. They've really let the advertising take over. Yeah. Which one are you going to take home? Which one do you like? Um, I will take fresh mistletoe home. Mistletoe? Put it above your head. And <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think you're getting somewhere, button. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Should I hold it up? Yeah. Oh, wait. They're actually going to fucking kiss from an advertisement? Is it that fucking easy? Really? Why are they so down to shill? This is crazy. They just met, and they're going to kiss for a deodorant because it's called mistletoe? That's a leap, right? Am I crazy to say that was a leap? How much are you guys getting paid? That I mean, that's that's impressive. That's impressive that the button was able to... The button's got W Riz. All right, there it is. There's the button. Honestly, the last one a little more exciting. That was the uh, that was the, the first time I've ever seen somebody qu quit the button just because they couldn't handle the people on it. Uh, and I will quit watching the button. This is going to be my last button video of uh, the year. <laughs> but can't promise I'm not starting up again in 2023. <laughs>